We turn now to a David and Goliath showdown tonight. The stay-at-home mom and those two t-shirts. The one she's wearing, that's her invention, and the one she's holding now being sold at Target. What do you think? Did they borrow from her idea? Tonight, that mom speaking out right here, saying it's no coincidence. Here's ABC's Neil Karlinski. Imitation may be the sincerest form of flattery, but Melissa Lay says retail giant Target flat out stole her best-selling design. Total shock. It was almost surreal seeing it there in, in a store I shop at. The stay-at-home mom started this t-shirt business out of her Oregon garage last year. You work so hard on these designs. I screen print till my body aches. Which is why she couldn't believe it when friends started sending her photos. So here's my design. A shirt she says is almost identical to hers, being sold by Target. It didn't take us long to find it. Here it is at this Target store, listed for $12.99. That's about half as much as Melissa's selling it for. We've followed these kinds of fights before. That won't stop the bionic. Dan Brown, inventor of the bionic wrench, told David that Sears copied his tool with a version made in China. What did you think when you saw it? It's a knockoff. There's no question. Sears says they didn't steal anything. And tonight, Target has sent Melissa this note saying they take the matter seriously and have begun an investigation. Melissa says her t-shirt battle is David versus Goliath, and she's counting on Target to do the right thing. Neil Karlinski, ABC News, Seattle.